today I'm going on a journey. A journey into the past. In fact, some 400 million years back into the past, looking for fossil trilobites. Firstly, I shall need some tools. A geologist's hammer, a metal bolster, nice and sharp, so I can cut rocks, and my favourite tool of all, a steel jemmy bar. This cutting contains some sedimentary rocks. Hopefully in amongst them we might find some fossils. And it's in with the jemmy bar. Got to push this in between the rocks to force the layers apart. Well here is a fossil. It's a strand of crinoid which is a good sign. Crinoids look like fossilized plants but they are in fact primitive sea creatures. Well this is the tail or the pygmium of a dalmanite trilobite. Sometimes the shells are attached and that's this white residue. Here is the other end of the trilobite, its head or glabella forming an impression in the rock. Now I've moved to a quarry in Wales. Here the rocks are being broken up for roadstone or ballast. This is an old part of the quarry. Difficult to see any fossils as the rocks have been exposed to the elements of weather and algae. Despite this, there is a tiny trilobite emerging from the slate. It's a trinoculus trilobite, a type I've never seen before. Terrific, but hard to photograph being so small. And here is an ogygenius trilobite, small but in perfect condition. And here is another, but this is just an impression.
as you can see, this is still a working quarry. This is a deep stream cut gully. Here the stream cuts down into the dark bedrock beneath. As I move along the valley, I sample the scree of loose rocks for evidence of ancient life. It's a wild place, reminiscent of the woodland in the lost world. Full of fallen trees and debris washed down the stream during floods. Further downstream, I found evidence of fossilization. A little further on, I found a spree of slates that looked rather interesting. Now there's a beauty. And here's the evidence. On this rock wall, you can see the clear imprint of trilobites. And more in this rock. This looks like another tail of an obligenius trilobite. And more in this rock. This looks like another tail of an obligenius trilobite. And under this rock, Big Daddy, a huge imprint of a large trilobite. Trilobites 
were very interesting and amazing creatures living in the ancient shallow ocean and are found on every continent on earth. They were probably the most successful creatures that ever existed. They survived on earth longer than any life form for at least 200 million years or more. dark bedrock. 